Got it. Welcome to Zappos.com campus, located in the fabulous downtown Las Vegas, Nevada. I'm Chet Cupcake, co-anchor of Primetime Edition of Zappos Game Center. I'm joined here by my fantastic co-host, Xander Twilight. Uh, Xander just returned to ZGC after a traumatic areola injury. Good to have you back. How's the nips? Oh, they're a little tender but perky there, Jed. Um, you know, I'm still hoping for the feeling to come back to the left one. Uh, it's a great day here at uh, Zappos downtown campus. Uh, you know, we have this really great game going on, Bears vs. Babies, from our good friends Matt Inman at The Oatmeal and Elin Lee. Elin Lee, I said that wrong, my bad. Uh, he put together this great game, and they were so kind enough to give us a couple advanced copies. I'm really excited. Uh, can't wait for this, huh, Jet? Totally. I can't wait for this. It's pretty amazing, the talent that they've assembled uh, at the table. I don't know if they could move the bar any lower, uh, but we are excited to see this group out here today. Uh, you know, we do have a quick video to give you guys an idea about the game we're playing and the rules. So let's cut to that quick video. Hi there, my name is Matthew Inman, I write The Oatmeal, and this is Alon Lee, he makes games. Last year we teamed up and created a card game called Exploding Kittens, and today we're here to tell you about our new game, Bears vs. Babies. Here's how the game works. You set our deck of cards face down and take turns drawing cards. There's basically two types of cards you can draw, bears and other creatures, and babies. Bears are built. You draw heads, torsos, arms, legs, and so on. You connect them to form an army of creatures in front of you. Suppose you had this head and this body in your hand. You could connect them and create a bald eagle made of chainsaws. Or if you had these two, you could make a Pomeranian wearing incredible underpants. Or if you had these three, a baby owl in business attire wearing spooky cat feet. Or suppose you had all these cards. You could build a shark in a festive turtleneck who can run at the speed of light. The second type of card in the game are babies. Babies go immediately into the center of the table and they form a massive baby army, which must be stopped by all the players in the game. There's big old diaper babies, torpedo babies, a scary hair baby, and even a beard baby. The goal is to build a creature army that's stronger than the baby army. You compute the strength of the creatures by the number of cards it contains. This creature has three cards, so it's worth three. There are currently only two babies on the table, so if you were to battle them, you'd win and eat those babies. They'd go into your tummy, which is the pile of baby cards you've eaten. Whoever eats the most babies by the end of the game wins. The trick is to provoke the babies before your opponents are ready. You do this by interrupting nap time by playing a provoke card. If your opponent's creatures aren't strong enough when the babies are provoked, their creatures are eaten by the babies and wiped from the table. So even though you're fighting an army of babies, you're really fighting each other. There's also power-ups you can put on your creatures, such as hats, weapons, and tools. You can chop off your opponent's limbs and mess with each other's monsters. It's a hilarious game of strategic, benevolent betrayal, where you get to build god-awful slash incredible-looking monsters who eat god-awful slash incredible-looking babies. It takes a few minutes to learn, it's kid-friendly, and each round takes about 20 minutes to play. All the cards are illustrated by me, The Oatmeal, and Ilana and I have spent the past year designing the game. So, if you want to play a game where you get to build tank Pomeranians and Barracuda fighter jets who go to war against horrible, horrible babies, please, back our Kickstarter. In return, we'll send you our game. Thank you very much. Well, that video pretty much sums it up, but you're going to get a lot of action as we move to the gaming table, and we are one of the very first groups that uh, gets to play this fantastic game. I can't wait to see the monsters they build and the babies they eat. With that, Xander, uh, who's sitting in position one? Yeah, well, you know there, Jet, we said that we had the lowest bar of contestants today, and I think these people set that bar pretty low. Introducing first is Vic Sage. You Vic might know Sage. him as one of the members of the Justice League, that faceless guy that you can never remember. Uh, well, today he's a little too hairy for our preferences, but <laughs> good luck to you, Vic. Next up, we have Blue Ivy's secretary. Uh, when Blue Ivy's not looking for the freshest ingredients for fruit snacks, whatever the hell that means, uh, he likes to spend time deba to debating how long it takes to get to the center of a Tootsie Pop. Uh, you know, for me, that sounds a little too sexual, but let's see if he can use that in his advantage. Uh, the third one we have is Angina. You know, I like to describe Ann as a real heart attack of a person. Uh, whenever I see her anywhere, I start to bust out the defibrillators and count my cholesterol points. So uh, welcome, Ann. Let's hope you make it to the end. And you know, if your left arm starts to tingle, be careful. Uh, the last one is Luscious Von Crimson. 
Uh, well, you can see how she's dressed in the frame right there. A little too S&M for my taste, but we're going to see again if she can use that dominating power to her advantage. So good luck to all of you. Uh, yeah. Back to you, Jet. Yeah, I am really, really excited by the talent assembled here today. I just flipped over the announcer table and I didn't even use my hands. Let's all salute the players today in this game. With that, let's cut over to the main table and get this game started. All right. All right. You ready? Oh, yeah. All right. So, so we're going to start gonna first with uh, the bet. Looks I told like you guys to bring something that you wanted to bet. All right. So we got this. drop it on the table. <laughs> All right, I'm what you got, Angela? I'm betting my child. Your firstborn? <laughs> my firstborn. I'm betting the one and only Super Punch Out. Oh, throwing it back. I'm betting the box, the Hello Kitty box, where Blue Ivy keeps the deeds to her multiple properties. You're Blue Ivy, and that's all you brought? That's all I brought. It's okay, I'm going to bring a throwback. My you only, want real estate? Is that my only Morris? cell phone. <laughs> <laughs> I've had this forever. No. All right, uh, you guys ready to play? Oh, yeah. You mean Sweet. you're ready to lose? Yeah. Ooh. It's going down. All right. Everybody pick monster. I choose the best one. All right. Don't show anybody, obviously. Uh, four cards. As soon as you get a baby card, don't forget it needs to be discarded in the either land, sea, or air baby army base. Uh, discard piles at the end. I'll split these up. What we don't need. Everyone gets four cards. Make sure you don't got no babies in here. I don't want no babies here. No competition for blue. All right. All right. Son of a dishwasher. All right. All right, I got two babies. Oh, I got all the babies. Two cards, please. Two cards. Two cards. Thank How many cards? Two. two. How many cards? Oh. One, two. All right, so good. Will you put those on the discard table? <coughs> all right. Who had to travel the farthest to get here today? Just kidding, we all work here. Carry you <laughs> <laughs> And Jenna. We'll go uh, clockwise from you. All right. Hope you can use that to phone a friend. Well, I'm going to start off with the sloth. The sloth. Slow but furious. <laughs> action one. And for my second action, I'm going to draw a baby. A baby. A baby. baby. <laughs> draw me like right. one of your French girls. Draw me like draw one, me of, your one of your French babies. babies. <laughs> 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 All right, I see your land sloth. I'm going to start with a bunny. And uh, yeah, give me a draw. Let's do. Oh yeah. Keep oh going. okay. All right. Yes, nothing. Uh, <laughs> don't just you wait. I'm gonna start out with the magnificent Unipug. <laughs> That's. Amazing. And then I'm gonna draw a card because I want to do things with other things. Uh, I'm done. No? I'm done. Right. For my first action, I'm gonna play the Zappos mascot. The llama. The llama. The land llama. Doesn't have Aren't extra they points all here. Land <laughs> all right. And for my second action, I'm going to draw and place a Pomeranian of light and wonder. Oh. Mm. All right. We all got heads down. Well, I'm thinking. Why do we need heads down, Josh? No, we all got heads down. For my first action, have I'm going to draw. Oh, no. Oh. Ugh. Already? All Already. Right. So the provoke card for everybody watching, what you do is you get to provoke one of the baby armies <coughs> to fight one of our just heads of a monster. Well, well she gets we all color. have grass. She gets to pick the Please color. don't pick land. I'm not because we're all going to lose. Sweet. So um, don't, don't I have to choose one? Yeah, yeah but it, but don't those babies go away? No, because there's no, nobody to fight, no to fight. All right, game on. Oh, oh right. I still have an action, because that was my first you action. So you're not going to use a uh, provoke? No. Let's see. I'm going to draw. And do that. One of my favorite parts of this game is I can still see who hasn't used their bare head. Because the back Cheater. of the card is different. Well, the back of the card is different. She's cheating. <laughs> but now can you... Yes. And I want to give him a festive turtleneck. He also sucks at dancing. Two moves. Up to Blue Ivy. You know what? A fun life. Just, <laughs> you know, uh, as Blue Ivy's secretary, I really just actually manage her ex uh, Excel accounts and her spreadsheets. That would make more sense. Um, but, you know, she has a lot of investments, and later we have a meeting with the Prime Minister. Um, I'm going to go ahead and provoke the land babies. <sighs> Why? Because okay. I can't. When you I yell can. provoke, I'm omitting both of my turns to provoke the land babies 
All these land babies are gonna attack. All right. So, land baby army, how many points do we have on the board? I have four. You have a four. I have a whopping two. 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 Sorry, Unipod. Five. All right. Two. Five. Yeah. Okay. So, because the land baby army has more points than any of our monsters, we all die. Fantastic. Good job. <laughs> hey, if you all, all right. die, you, you don't get bud. the cards. I don't like playing with you anymore. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Can I see your sloth there? Oh, uh, yeah, sure. All right. Oh, it's my is it my turn already? Yep. It is. All right. You provoked and killed us off. I did. I'll do it my again. My first action, I'm going to draw a card, which I'm going to hold on to. My second action, I'm going to hold on to my second card that I draw. <laughs> that narrating right. is perfect. Yeah. She has perfect. Well, very no, exciting. Keep it up. Very Good exciting. Job. I'm going to draw. Oh my. I'm going to show my cards to everyone at home because I can. And they're terrible. If you guys Mine can text better. me what and I'm is actually holding them. And I'm going to draw for my second and I'm good. Okay. Yeah, I'm going to draw two. Oh. And. Dang it. Baby. Right. Baby. Okay. So this is game one of three. <laughs> We're playing best two out of three. I'm just going to play I win all three. We're all not going to need all three because I'm going to win right. the first two. Alright. I'm going to go ahead and draw one. How many points do you have? No, I was here first. And it doesn't matter, I'm okay. going to play ahead and get my monster started. Get a Velociraptor going. Somebody That's provoke. That's a cousin of mine. <laughs> <laughs> I can tell. The people I don't close know. family relations. Is someone delivering this Taco Bell again today? Because that'd be awesome. Oh, well, that would be amazing. Uh, no? I'm down. Naked Chalupa? Pizza, maybe. Taco Bell, if you're watching, can you send us <laughs> is a good? Is it my turn? It's, it's yeah, all it's you. All right. Nicola Baltra, if you're also watching, can you send us something? <laughs> all right. I drew, for my first action, I drew a card that was going to kick some butt later. Oh. Watch is out. It though? No. And I drew another card that I have to hold on to. I'm so excited to see you hold an entire deck. I know. <laughs> <laughs> but it it matches. Queen of the cards. Gonna have hand cramps soon. <laughs> Queen of the deck. <laughs> if only she had T-Rex arms. Wouldn't be a problem. My hands aren't really that small. <laughs> it's just my arms. Thank you for calling that out, Karen. Well, she just can't read the dis reach the discard pile. Okay. Like the camera's at ten hundred. Like. <laughs> It is your arms. I don't know. It's your turn. Come on, Karen from finance. Susan. <laughs> That's right. I'm Karen. Okay, I'm going to draw. And for my first action. And then for my second, I'm going to play with my mask. Oh. And I'm the one that's a little... Uh, cannot not, like, see. What, what, did, I, what did the co lovely commentator say about my... Uh, my attire that I was oh, a little, little S&M. I'm the S&M one. You've got the mask on yours. Wow. Well, <laughs> Mystery Go on. <laughs> We're not going to talk about this now. <laughs> I'm going to grab a card. <coughs> I have a ton of awesome body parts, but no... Yeah, you do. That's what we've heard. Thank you. <laughs> From zero, who? Zero. I, I don't From a whom? Zero people. <laughs> oh? Josh uh, told me. Uh, uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Right. I'm a reliable witness. What are you doing? You done? Oh, yeah, it's your turn. Fine. All right. I'm going to beef up this Velociraptor. He's ready to do some lumberjacking. Somebody provoke. <laughs> Not only is he ready to do some lumberjacking, he also is a Velociraptor with T Rex arms. What? Unstoppable oh. force of nature. Unless it's something that's far away. Unless it's beyond three feet. <laughs> yeah, and then. Then we're just out of luck. I like how he has nunchucks to help. Yeah. See, that's the thing. He has an additional effective range of but about. It doesn't a go one that far, feet. though. Like, it's trust like... me, I know. <laughs> Look, don't bully <laughs> your problems onto my <laughs> T Rex arms. All right. All right. First action, I'm gonna draw a stupid baby. Provoke. Yeah, yeah, go ahead and provoke it. Go ahead, do it. And for my second action, I'm gonna play my beaver. <laughs> All, All right. right. Well, with that being said, <laughs> I'm gonna draw for my first. Um. Okay, so. I'm able to put this down and it still counts as one because it's a 
pick and play. Yes. <laughs> and then I'm going to add some weird, I don't know, pig hand with machine guns and shotgun. Not entirely sure what that really I is. I it's like the right to bear arms. Uh, it's, like it's a bear I bear feel arm. like it's a pig. That's bearing arms. It's like pig skin or something. Maybe that's gross. what a bear looks like when you shave it. I don't know. It's pretty gross. gross. All right. All right. You got both? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to draw from this one. This one's been doing well. Ah, bless it. <laughs> this, this literally doesn't help at all. What about... Let's do this. Okay. You good? Don't, don't look, Blue Ivy, but I'm going to show everyone at home my cards. Oh, all right. Okay. Don't play games with I, me. I, I cheat. I have no heads. Oh. All right. <laughs> if only I hadn't heard what you just said. I have no heads. <laughs> no heads. <laughs> all right. So I could beef up huh? my Velociraptor ready to do some lumberjacking with T-Rex arms. <laughs> or... So is your Velociraptor going to ruin its environment by cutting all the trees down that it lives within? It's a jungle? Aww. That's sad. Look, no, she's environmentally conscious. Sustainable uh, You know trees. what? I'm going to go ahead and attach a friggin' sweet Robo Hammer. What that does, it'll add an extra action per turn, effective immediately. I'm gonna, so you get three actions. I get three actions now, so which means I really get Uno Mas. Do I want to add one uh, more? Taco. One Tucker, that's what this Three. For. You know what? Live mouse. It's a Velociraptor. He has T Rex arms. Let's give him a claw. Oh my. Let's give him a claw. Uh, I don't. That poor Velociraptor. Right? Look, I, I don't see what the problem is here. I just found a head in my deck. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> I just found a head that I forgot I had. <laughs> Alright, for my first action, I'm going to draw and put it in my hand. <laughs> And for my second action, I'm going to lay down my um, torso card. It's now a beaver armed with knives and burritos. Mm. Ask one of those burritos over here. They're that mine. I'm starving. You're asking the game Mr. question? I yes. need them to fight the That's beaver, it. baby. So when you play the mask, yep. am I allowed to put a hat on that mask? Yeah, of course. Yeah. Okay, then. So <laughs> I'm going to add a saucy sombrero onto my head. Well, then. My what head. do do? So the hat doubles the amount of points for the monster. How, like many, how many points do you have so far? Uh, well, I can't tell you what's under my mask. No, you can't. Try. I tried to trick you. So you don't have to tell me. Three here. So as of right now, for all you know, it's six. Okay. <laughs> Valid. Okay. And for my second, I'm gonna draw and actually use this. So now I just have a really Creepy, whatever this is. Go on. All right. <laughs> my first action, I'm going to play a head. For all you know, there's a head down there. I'm kidding. I'm not going to lie. Um, I'm going to get rid of this card early because last time I was holding on to it, it didn't help. I'm going to dismember. So dismember card, as soon as I dismember whatever body part I take off, it goes in the discard pile. Masks and faces stay together, but hats, Go that's a totally that. different appendage. However... Why are you looking at me when you say hats? However, <laughs> the card that I'm going to dismember is Mr. Three Points over here. Yeah. He doesn't have a monster anymore, so he doesn't get to play his three points. He's back down to two actions. I really want to tongue pop right now, but I know our viewers will not appreciate that. You're going to pop a speaker. <laughs> <laughs> if you do that, Everybody in Wisconsin, cover your ears. <laughs> someone's computer speaker will always play. Okay, cool. All right, you done? <laughs> yes. Great. Fantastic. Um, I'm going to go ahead and reactivate my monster uh, uh, uh. by stitching on a polar bear head. I forgot that we all have Now that. worth <laughs> more points than before, so thank you so much for that. No problem, that bud. also allows me to use my Robo Hammer, which gives me two additional actions. So I'm going to go ahead and draw one. I'm going to go ahead and draw one of these. And I got a child. A small... Is it a full-grown child or is it a Is baby? it twins? Oh my. <laughs> <laughs> Look, we don't talk about that. That's a rough time in my family right now. <laughs> okay. I'm good. Back in action. All right. So for, for my first action, I'm going to ease my hand cramping and give my beaver a claw. 
And then for my second action, I'm gonna add a friggin' sweet robo hammer to that claw and give myself an extra turn. And for that extra turn, I'm going to draw. And I'm gonna play my happy squid. Oh, sweet. We all know what I'm looking for. Oh, shoot. The handsome. <laughs> the handsome salmon. <laughs> handsome salmon. Handsome so, salmon will make an appearance, potentially. I'm gonna be a real jerk. Are and you? I'm gonna dismember your polar bear head. <laughs> yes! Can you stop playing with my head? <laughs> Never. And it's gone. And I am going to draw for so my second. Ooh. So like this to this monster, I'm gonna. This monster is also gonna be pregnant with dolphin babies. I feel like one of our announcers has a dolphin story. He's not supposed to talk on camera anymore, so please don't. Um, and I'm gonna add pants. So this potential mask is pregnant with dolphin babies and can run at the speed of light. Dang! I didn't even know dolphins had legs. Blue Ivy. Blue Ivy secretary. Don't get it twisted, Blue she Ivy's will not let me come home if I... <laughs> <laughs> Alright, well, since I don't have a head, I can't do a thing with this monster, I'm gonna try to get another head. Drew, drew one. Nothing super useful, unless I can get... Use, use that one. Unless I can get a bite. You want me to use that one? Okay, cool. I'm gonna get right on that. <laughs> I'm gonna draw on one more. And... <laughs> And it was a child, so I cannot use it. All right, for my first action of many, I mean three, but that's a lot more than you guys have. Yeah, no, um, I'm going to dismember Kara's saucy sombrero. Oh, uh, saucy hat. <sighs> Worth nothing. For Bogart. For Bogart. And then I'm Take going to down. give my happy squid some business attire, because we are at work. And super strict dress code here at right, it's super strict. And then for my third one, I'm gonna draw and I'm gonna give my squid, happy squid, in business attire, a peg leg. Does he work on Ardes? Ar. <laughs> What's a pirate? Fa pirate's favorite letter? Q. Q. R. You would think so, but it's actually the C. <laughs> <laughs> I that see what you the did worst there. Joke I've ever heard in my life. <laughs> oh, I got words. <laughs> I know, I've heard yours. You're too good. <laughs> All right, I'm going to revisit high school right now and drop the piggy in a prom dress. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's like looking at my high school pictures. I feel that's when I picked it up and I was like, man, this, this is, is high school. This is relatable. <laughs> oh, goodness. What are you going to do with your light speed dolphin twins? My light speed running dolphin. I'm going to draw a card. Oh, come on. Damn it. Head. Let's see what we got. Oh, and we got a baby. So if everybody at home are just tuning in, whenever we draw a baby, we gotta put it in the pile so our monsters can fight these baby armies. Are you picking a cute baby to show? Then none of them are cute, Kara. <laughs> that real fat one is. The big old, big old diaper, diaper baby. baby. Big old diaper baby. Big old diaper baby. Um, I like the cuddlefish I like baby. The scary hair baby. I like the bearded baby. I wonder why. Relatable. Uh, All I right. Came out like this. I feel like that's what your children are gonna come <laughs> came out, out like. with a diploma and a briefcase. Daughter yeah. and everything. All right. I drew a card. Rude. I got, I got that. Can't do a whole lot with it because I still don't have a head. And uh, I got a, I got a child. So it has to go right back down to that, uh, that baby pile. All right. All right, let's see. For my first session, I'm going to draw a shark head. Can you stop? Yeah. Dun it, dun it, dun it. And for my Wait. second action, I'm going to draw again. And I have to provoke the land babies. Oh, land no. babies. Oh, shucks. So, right. I, I only have sea babies. So we have no sea over here. We have no monsters over here. We have a two and whatever this guy three. is. Three. So three. Four, five, so six, now because... I have to use this because it's a rainbow and it counts yep. for any of them. They also count as three. It not counts two. as three. So I have three, ten. six, ten. Ten. eight, nine, ten. ten. I'd like to count. Okay. I'm good at counting. So because I unfortunately mostly using a grizzly, I have six. Womp womp. So one, 
zero to uh, we would have both beat this army of three points however since she beat it harder she gets those three points <laughs> <laughs> well she beat it harder then. better so now we've so got I the gotta, points on the board oh, shoot. Well, the flower baby isn't that bad looking. No, the flower baby's cute. It's vomiting its children, but... You can also turn them over, too, and let everyone see them. Uh -huh. Because you own those babies Tank now. Tank baby, <coughs> fake baby, which, you know... Oh, I get one more turn, don't I? Yeah. Yep. And for my third one, I'm going to draw a space lobster. Get it. Wee, 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 wee. Okay, so since I have really nothing, I'm going to draw... Oh my, oh. that's adorable. And I can't really play anything, so I'm going to draw again. And it's a baby, so I have to drop it. Drop it like it's hot. Drop it, drop it, drop it like it's hot. Let's do. Alright, guys. I have a whole lot of no heads, so I got to draw. Oh. Oh. Might have been a head. Oh. When I use this, everybody at home, I'll tell you what this does. I don't want to say it aloud because Blue Ivy was peeking, but they don't know what it is. I, I am with the... You are in the lie eye line. I get it. I don't <laughs> I have a camera you over play your with shoulder. Me, <laughs> Cover his eyes next time. All right, second drop. Ooh, I got the handsome salmon. Handsome salmon. Nice. Rude. Rude. I got the handsome salmon. Business Sorry. fish. Business. Oh, well, the business tires over there. Yeah. All right. All right you good? Fish. I like to make him into a lumberjack. I'm going to go ahead and draw, and I drew another child. So I'm going to go ahead and put that right back down, unfortunately. Oh, boy. Clearly, we do not like children. I got this card, and that means I'm going to provoke all the sea babies right yeah. away. All right. Well, I mean, it is. All right. Have two Hopefully, there, there goes the handsome salmon. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Nine, ten points. This sea baby army has to beat ten points. What do we got? This needs to be eleven. Two, two. points. Oh, baby. Four. Four. baby torpedo. I've seen one of those in real life. Seven. seven. Super ugly crab baby. Seven. Uh oh. Eight. Uh oh. So we have, there has to be this last card has to be a one or it's a, a one stalemate. Or, yeah, if it's a stalemate. If it's a stalemate, I'm keeping everything. You keep everything, all the babies go. That's right. If, you, if it's eleven points, we kill all those monsters That's on right. the board. If it's if it's if it's eleven, though, if it's nine, we still kill all the, the yeah. Oh yeah, but you don't get any points. Right. Flip it over. I hope it's a three. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all right, so we get to Have kill all here, those sea <laughs> monsters <laughs> and the baby. <laughs> now she only has two points. You guys are jerks. <laughs> Blame the babies. We all do. <laughs> Ooh, who provoked? Who called that card? Oh, he did. I also lose I my did. hands. Do you want to say bye? Who I be secretary? Can we give him a little? He's so handsome. He's handsome. I love him. He's, He's all, such a handsome all of his teeth. Handsome. Do you still have another turn? Do you still have another turn? Uh -huh. All right. I do not have another turn, unfortunately. I'm going to try and rebuild my... Dog, yeah. come on. Yeah. America. Bill Belichick. America. And a pigeon with some health problems. That's my least favorite. You should show the camera that one. That one's cool. That one's adorable. <laughs> He's got like a little bit He's of... He's got lots yeah. of eyes. Pus somewhere. He's got some sores. He's drooling a bit. I can't look at that one. He needs... He needs... To go to the doctor. <laughs> <laughs> all right. I'm going to try a different pile this time. Yeah, she has all the heads. Yeah. Sorry again. All right. It's fine. I'm just ro rocking I here with my, with, that, with my headless critter. So we're going to go to the middle one. And I can't do anything with that, but they are adorable to look at. All right. I have an entire body. But no head. Welcome to my world. All right. Oh, it's a good one too. So this, this is a good card. I'll, 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 I'll tell you why when I get to play it. I was looking All right. a little bit. Did I draw twice? I don't know. I only draw once. Did you draw twice? Drew once. Sorry. I can't tell. Judges. So we got Judges. And it's another child. And it's another air baby. 
Is that, um, like a, is that a euphemism is. for like a fart? <laughs> it is now. You know what? I keep eating these Doritos and I have all sorts worse. of air babies. <laughs> <laughs> I had chili for lunch. You can stay on your side of the house. <laughs> um, you know what? Do Provoke it. the air babies! Provoke the air babies. Ew. There are three heads no air of air babies. Right, they're out to six get points. me. Two, four, six. No Eight. Who do we appreciate? We need, <laughs> we need to beat six points. <laughs> Blue Ivy, you ready? I'm ready. Let's see how you're provoked. Did. I'm ready to take I'm one by pet. Whoa. Ready to take one by pedal burrito. By pedal burrito burrito. Bipedal. One more time. By pedal. Say the whole thing. By pedal burrito, baby. How's that for an alliteration? Say bipedal that five burrito. times fast. By pedal burrito, baby. What are you just here? I'm proud of you. I can't hear myself. So, Shrevy Shay, baby. That's. Cute baby, it's getting flungy. Yeah, because it's flying through the air out of our area. Yeah, we don't want it. Fake baby. All oh, things are looking up. Two points. Not that far up though. Three points. Butterfly axe baby. Two points. It's four. Fighter jet five. baby. I'm bad at counting. It's five eight, five points right now. So you need this to be a, a one. A zero. A zero. Don't let me down, you need a air fake babies. baby. I need a fake baby or a one. Aerial ordinance, baby three. Dang, man. Lose all those heads. <laughs> all right, air babies win. Dang. Blue Ivy's the second provoke. Yeah, Killed you're it. kicking my butt right now. I'm telling you, we gotta. If I can't have a head, you can't have three. There are no sea baby Arby's. <laughs> Just wait. Uh -oh. All right. Oh no, sorry. Yeah, it's all you, Ursula. All right, so I'm gonna. I get. I haven't done any actions, right? Yeah. I'm gonna draw and place my baby owl head. Got more heads already. <laughs> and I'm gonna make that baby owl carry a knife cat. Because knife what's cat. more dangerous than an owl than a knife cat? Not one of those. A knife cat? A knife yeah. cat. Or an owl. Is it a daughter or is it just straight? Nope. Her name is Ponyo. She has a, a switchblade underneath her tail. Me and my cat. That's, box. that's her butthole. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I got the mantis shrimp. There is a oatmeal comic about the mantis shrimp. Have you read it? No, not yet. Now so I will. It has these little claw things that literally like flip at the speed of sound, and they shoot out so hard that so they like take off like predators. Like they, they th that it actually food. boils the water around it. Well, now crazy. They're because they're I just hungry. because so I just pretty. learned that. I'm gonna make sure it's flexible and put it in a delightful leotard. Oh, <laughs> perfect. Those punches count. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Matches. It brings out the pink in his eyes. It does. <laughs> it does. It matches. That's cute. There's like a little bit of hair. Um, okay. Sexy. Yeah. Not so much. Like a. Who's that one? Guy who? Oh, dang it! I have the gross one. The one that some of you don't like. Scary hair, baby. That was my favorite. All right. I gotta put that in the land, baby army. Let's draw one, draw two. Come on, weird head. Oh, well, that's a thing. Blue Ivy shouldn't be looking at it. I can't take it. Blue Ivy's <laughs> so bad at, at I'm blind. I always Blue screen watched. Blue Ivy, is it Blue Ivy's secretary. Blue Ivy's secretary, I'm sorry. I'm telling you, don't get it twisted. She will not let me come back home. I just want to remind you guys that I'm winning as of right now. Yeah. What do you have? You know. Flip them over for the audience. <laughs> I'll flip them over to the audience, not so much for you. I'm just creating a false sense of security for you all. Yeah, I appreciate <laughs> it. Lulling me. All right, cool. I'm going to go ahead and draw because I still am headless. Oh, if only I could put that somewhere. But I can't. I'm going to draw another one. And we're back in the game. Oh. I got a pterodactyl ready to do some lumberjacking with T-Rex arms and a crab claw. <laughs> uh, and I've also got... You got your third point back. I show enough do. You threw an action back. I would like to... Uh, you know, I've been saving this for a long time. I'm going to go ahead and give him some terrific boots. Uh, where could you buy those boots? I could buy them at Zappos.com. I bet you could. Or Luxury Zappos. Zappos Luxury. Zappos, Zappos Luxury. <laughs> Maybe right. 6 p.m. So, <laughs> I pulled <laughs> one, pulled one, pulled another one, placed it, 
And, you and I put on my boots. Yep. So that's that three. All right, that's my three. So it's my turn. All right, for my first action, I'm going to give my baby owl some squid legs. As well you should. And I'm going to draw a manatee, the mermaid of the sea. The mermaid of the sea. What was the fun fact you told no, us about mermaids? I didn't tell you a fun fact. One that of my mom just did, answers. and we were asked not to tell that story. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Okay. Well, with that, I am Don't do it. actually going to make him a very patriotic mantis shrimp and put on the hat of freedom. Oh. <laughs> and also... Feel like he needs some cool cyborg legs. I can see that. I agree. Yeah. You just need some arms. I know. All right, let's go over here. Bless it. It's got lasers for eyes. It's pretty cool. Air baby army. Man, I haven't gone here in a minute. I have all the torsos if anyone needs one. All right. Womp womp. I'm going to go ahead and beef up this pterodactyl. Is it pterodactyl or is it pterodactyl? Pterodactyl. The P is silent. Look, I'm not here for your English. Yeah. Um, hey, here's another joke. How, how can you tell? Or, why can't you hear the pterodactyl when he's going to the bathroom? Because the P is silent. I'm actually going to just pretend I didn't hear that. <laughs> okay. um, you can bring all those jokes back to Blue Ivy. I, she would promptly ask, <laughs> ask for me. my immediate resignation. So I'm going to beef up my pterodactyl with a party before. hat. Now this pterodactyl is bumping, so I'm also going to... But it's only worth two, three... Four, five, ten points. So, one, oh, two, eight. three, four, oh, five, sorry, six, points. twelve points. Twelve points. That's a pretty, uh, so pretty impressive pterodactyl. All right, I'm drawing another card. And it's going to be effective immediately, my friggin' sweet power drill. You so, have a full beefed up monster. I have a, when you need it. Full, a fully beefed well, monster. So, I also get, I get what? Two, so I, wait. I put down my hat, I drew the power drill, and I played it, so I still have two more, because my Robo Hammer my extra turn anyway. Look at that, how's that for math? Alright. We're not good at counting. I'm not good at counting. We're gonna provoke anyway. Yeah. Yeah, go ahead. Go ahead and do it. No. Go ahead. And I got one more of those, but I'm done. Alright, I'm gonna draw. This card that I'm gonna hold in my hand. Ooh. I'm gonna draw again. And make my manatee into oh. a sweet taco. Dang it. Is it bipedal? It's <laughs> sure. I know. It's it got two sense. legs, it's standing up on two legs, that would qualify it to be bipedal. I, just I should have sold like ad rights right here for this camera. To Zappos.com? Ad space. I got a forehead for ad space. I got a five head for ad space. What I'm gonna do right now. Oh, oh. go ahead, do it. Really? They're poking. Cool. Air babies. Fantastic. Can't wait to win these baby cards. You're gonna win like a whole point. Point more Ooh, than. I you. apologize. It is five points. <laughs> <laughs> oh, but you did kill this entire. You did kill my monster fancy monster, but with you know one what? dragon baby and one laser tarot baby. Turdak, turd, yeah, tell me. Weird. That Orange. is all right with me, because you okay, know what? You now, no you know, well, you've served me well. Was that monster was in it till the end. You, you kept taking his head. Fire. That's fine. Well, That's fine. Doing nothing. <sighs> all right. Whose turn is it? It's not my turn. Oh, let me pull up all of this torso I got. All right, guys, wish me luck. I need a head. Or I'm just going to take this manish from head. Right off your monster. Well, you can't, you can't oh. Hat. Come on. That is kind of cute, though. I got a sea baby. Give me some more sea babies. Okay. I want to use this, but I can't yet. I can kind of see the reflection in your glasses. <laughs> <laughs> All right. My turn's over. All right. Go for Blue Ivy. Since we're starting from scratch, I'm going to go ahead and uh, 
draw a baby of sorts. Put that down immediately. Oh, I think those are contagious. Babies? Yeah. And unfortunately, more babies. Another baby pie. Build that water baby pile. All right, I'm gonna use my for my first action. I'm gonna give my taco a intravenous caffeine drip. Give myself an extra turn. So on my second action, I'm gonna draw a bat. And then I'm going to use my third and final action to draw a stupid baby. <laughs> God, baby. I would have the coolest monster if I just had a head. All right. So I have to draw because I cannot do anything. And of course, I draw the scariest baby I've ever seen. Did you show the camera? Is it a picture of me when I was a child? Might be. It's translucent. That's the creepiest this thing I've ever seen in my life. This might be a jellyfish? All right. That's pretty much what I look like. And so this is a really good card, but I can't use it yet, and nor would I want to because there's nothing out there. Okay, go on. Yeah. Okay, well, I have all the other body parts if anyone needs it. Oh, good. You like the Jeffrey Dahmer of this game. <laughs> Provoke? Provoke. Oh, yeah, you have a two-headed bad baby. Bumble baby, you get to keep your bats. Yeah, so we finally drew, I so don't she gets lose to keep the her poke. monster and the baby loses. Yep. Whenever there's a tie. I get to keep my monster, but the baby, and the baby goes baby away. the baby loses. But if that would have been a three. Yeah, well it's not because you have all the torsos. Yeah, I know. Trade your torso for your mantis. Alright. I'm drawing. Alright. I got the end of this first game. I got this guy right here. But I can't use them just yet. Josh, how does this game end? What happens? Uh, so, we're actually quite close because there's only two cards left to draw. Once all the draw piles have been used, everyone gets one more turn. And then we tally up who has the most baby points. The most baby points. I drew that one. For those just tuning in, Nick currently has, excuse me, Blue Ivy's secretary. I know. It's my Vic, Blue Ivy's secretary, Vic Sage. <laughs> Vic Sage. Karen, Karen from Finance. Excuse me. Karen, Karen from, from Finance has five baby points. <laughs> and Susan from Finance, I believe, only has three points. A two and a one. And I, along so, with Vic Sage, have big old zero. Fat Ze egg. Zilch. Ready? Yeah. I'm ready. I'm going to draw ready, a ready. Jabberwocky oh, head. And then for my other action, I'm going to draw... A card I can't tell you about. Well, we'll use that. Well, actually, we won't, probably won't use that. We might. We might. Well, Come on, Susan. there's nothing I really can do. Good. You can provoke. You can provoke. <laughs> yeah. I'm going to. I hope you don't. Well, I hope you don't do that. But you could. You should. Because the only thing that I might do is. <laughs> I to think about that. So, those at home, she's curious if she should provoke the C, because she might win. She can't see how many points it's worth, but she can see that there's only four there's cards. Four there. cards. So, th these could be four ones, four zeros, four threes. <laughs> how, you many, know what? how many points do you have? Let's live life on the edge. So, well, we have two, three, five, and then plus Ten. the half. Ten. She won. And how many water points? I live have life on the edge of the toilet. three. Three. All right, this needs to be less than 10. You ready? I hope so. No, First card. I don't hope so. <laughs> Portuguese mana baby. Oh my. <laughs> Two points. Second. One point. Naked jet ski baby. <laughs> it is a really good card. That is a We're really gonna pause for card. the naked jet ski baby. That's pretty. That's pretty beautiful. My hands are sweating. <laughs> oh, that's wonderful. Are your knees weak? Well, I don't know. I'm sitting down. Mom's spaghetti. <laughs> now I'm hungry. <laughs> Three points on the board. You need less than ten. Third card. Angler, baby. Oh, my. One point. I think you're probably pretty good. I don't think you're pretty good. You're pretty good because this last card is just zero. Fake, baby. No. All these baby points go to Kira. Oh, how rude. No. I have one thing that I can do, and I'm going to swap, and I'm going to swap your two heads. You have to move them. <laughs> all right, that's all I can do. That first game. With that first game coming to a close, how many points do we have on the table? Yeah, but... Oh, I'm sorry. Do you guys have... Yeah. Uh, what do you... Way to cut us out of the game. No, because he started... You drew the last two. 
I so still have I'm so sorry, Blue Ivy. You have. So I still have it. He still has oh, yeah. okay. You know what? Why not? Oh, yeah. This is a really exciting game. Pretty amazing that you got. I want to make sure that it's made of meat and pain. <laughs> That's one of my favorite cards. I don't even know who won. Yeah. Congratulations to our winner. <laughs> the lullaby card. So the lullaby card is pretty much useless right now, but I can choose a baby army and discard half of it. Yeah, there's only so one card. You get to round up. You so get to I get to round up, card. so nobody gets any babies, suckers! All right, so that brings us to the close of this first game. We're going to play two more after this. How many baby points do we have on the board? We got five Blue fantastic baby, got, uh, baby points. Karen from Finance. She's Susan from Susan. Finance. Sorry, Susan. We've known each other for 45 years. I am so sorry. <laughs> it's showing. <laughs> Seven points. Winner oh. of this game, Susan from Finance. Susan Sorry. From Finance. Matt, who won? We're going to go back to our announcers. Take it back to you. I just lost the deed to Blue's Bora Bora properties. Welcome back. That was intense. I can't believe that bikini otter ate all those babies. Super, super intense. Well, congratulations to our winner of the first round. That was pretty amazing. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed it. It was a lot of action, a lot of babies, a lot of monsters, a lot of bears, a lot of weird arms and legs. But you put that all together, and it's pretty exciting. Do you have any final thoughts? Sure do there, Jet. Boy, what a fun game we had, you know? We want to thank the creators of the oatmeal and uh, Exploding Kittens, Elin Lee and... Matthew Inman, uh, this was a game where, you know, you can yell at your friends, you can laugh at your friends, you can yell, yell at your friends some more, maybe smack them up, but uh, as one bear to another right here, I, I have to say it's been a pretty fun day. <laughs> and with that, <laughs> we're going to sign out. We're out, we're signing out, and off, and gone. It's a bathroom break time. <laughs> Hi there, my name is Matthew Inman, I write The Oatmeal, and this is Alon Lee, he makes games. Last year we teamed up and created a card game called Exploding Kittens, and today we're here to tell you about our new game, Bears vs. Babies. Here's how the game works. You set our deck of cards face down and take turns drawing cards. There's basically two types of cards you can draw, bears and other creatures, and babies. Bears are built. You draw heads, torsos, arms, legs, and so on. You connect them to form an army of creatures in front of you. Suppose you had this head and this body in your hand. You could connect them and create a bald eagle made of chainsaws. Or if you had these two, you could make a Pomeranian wearing incredible underpants. Or if you had these three, a baby owl in business attire wearing spooky cat feet. Or suppose you had all these cards. You could build a shark in a festive turtleneck who can run at the speed of light. The second type of card in the game are babies. Babies go immediately into the center of the table, and they form a massive baby army, which must be stopped by all the players in the game. There's big old diaper babies, torpedo babies, a scary hair baby, and even a beard baby. The goal is to build a creature army that's stronger than the baby army. You compute the strength of the creatures by the number of cards it contains. This creature has three cards, so it's worth three. There are currently only two babies on the table, so if you were to battle them, you'd win and eat those babies. They'd go into your tummy, which is the pile of baby cards you've eaten. Whoever eats the most babies by the end of the game wins. The trick is to provoke the babies before your opponents are ready. You do this by interrupting nap time by playing a provoke card. If your opponent's creatures aren't strong enough when the babies are provoked, their creatures are eaten by the babies and wiped from the table. So even though you're fighting an army of babies, you're really fighting each other. There's also power-ups you can put on your creatures, such as hats, weapons, and tools. You can chop off your opponent's limbs and mess with each other's monsters. It's a hilarious game of strategic, benevolent betrayal, where you get to build god-awful slash incredible-looking monsters who eat god-awful slash incredible-looking babies. It takes a few minutes to learn, it's kid-friendly, and each round takes about 20 minutes to play. All the cards are illustrated by me, The Oatmeal, and Ilana and I have spent the past year designing the game. So, if you want to play a game where you get to build tank Pomeranians and Barracuda fighter jets who go to war against horrible, horrible babies, please, back our Kickstarter. In return, we'll send you our game. Thank you very much.